hot. Consider all contacts hostile. Hey guys, what is going on? Stingray Von Gray here, bringing you a Black Ops 3 video here today. Um, a little bit of a different video today. As you guys can see in my hands there, I have the HG40. I had 400, or actually I have like 700 crypto keys. I ended up going ahead, or I went ahead and I spent, um, like, uh, I think it was like 400 of them. But, and I got this. Um, this was my first gameplay with me actually having it, alright? I have all, I know you guys are seeing like, um, you're seeing like the stock and all that pop up in level 7. That's because I picked it up so much before. And, yeah, I already had a lot of attachments for it, which was awesome. Especially when I finally got it. Um, anyways guys, um, I think that the supply drops may have had a buff and this is just my own theory I'm not sh you know there's not really you know I don't have any hard evidence behind it but you know it's just I never used to get this many good pulls in a row and by that I mean I never had all the guns this fast or you know all the new weapons I never had the HG40 and like you know probably six drops into spending all my crypto keys I had them, you know, it's, it's just, it's just weird, guys, I don't know. It could just be me, but I feel like they possibly buffed the, um, the drops, the supply drops. Um, I don't know, we'll see, I mean, let me know if you guys think so or not. I, I've been kind of, been having a real hard time with this, I really think they did. But, uh, let me know if you guys are feeling the same thing as I am with this whole, uh, supply drop thing, I really do think they buffed it, but anyways, guys, um, a really solid gameplay with this gun, and I had, uh, I heard some people say they didn't like it, some people really like it, um, you know, I, I really like it, I think it's a good gun, um, it's smooth, the only thing I notice is the hit detection on it is a little goofy, it, sometimes it's not how it should be, um, it's kind of weird, I don't know, like right there, like, I should have at least hit one of those bullets. I mean, I know that was an ugly aim, but at least I should have at least got one hit marker. But anyways, um, I don't know. It it just has a little bit of goofy, like like a hit box. The hit box isn't right on it or something. And yeah, I don't know, man. It, it was just weird. But overall, I mean, I really like the gun. I think it's a really good gun. Um, let me know what you guys got this weekend. If you got anything cool, throw it down in the uh, comment section. I'll be excited to hear. Um, what you guys got out of these supply drops. Um, I think there was a guy behind me. I, I just noticed, I, th I think there might have been a person behind me. Huh, well that was weird. Anyways, right here, um, here's where I actually end up dying. I was, I was so close to streaks. But I couldn't do anything, this guy was flying over my head. We went on a 20 gun streak the first uh, match with it, so, I mean, that was solid. A lot of these guys were playing very goofy, though, like, it's almost like they weren't trying or something. I don't know what it was, but it was really, really weird. I think people are just staying in matches nowadays to get crypto keys. I really don't think they're, you know, actually playing. I don't know, it's, it's really weird, though. But, um, yeah, guys, I mean, so go ahead and uh, if you got crypto keys, go spend them. And try to get this thing because it's uh it's pretty ridiculous. I actually like it a lot. Um, I hope you uh, I hope you guys did get something cool this weekend because this was definitely the weekend to do it. I feel like with all the uh, the wins and whatnot and all that. Um, you know, if you got your 75 wins and you got another weapon this weekend, I ended up getting the Iron Gym. That kind of sucked. I was okay with it though. I mean, I, I don't really have like. You know, that many really cool melee weapons, so I was kind of okay with the crowbar. And I also ended up getting the, uh, the FAMAS or whatever, the FFAR. That's a pretty yeah, solid gun, too. It, that one's a little more inaccurate, like, definitely this thing's more of a laser beam than that is. But, I don't know, you guys, uh, you guys have to tell me what you guys think, if you think the uh, FFAR is better or if the HG40 is better. But honestly, I, I, ever, like, once I played this game with it, I really really liked it. Went to punch that guy right there, by the way, and I missed. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I mean, I think this was, like, a double rap, double hater game, so, um, I mean, it, the proof's in the, uh, the gameplay. 
I mean, it was, it was pretty solid, but like I said, these guys weren't the best, and they were they were doing something like goofy, man. I mean, I had to fast forward to get to where we actually spawned in because we spawned in late. I was watching like half of them, like I don't know, like sitting in corners away for someone to come punch them, brass knuckles. I don't know if they were like boosting or what, but it was goofy. But um, anyways, right here is where I get the the streaks for the second time. It's a little too late. I mean, when you're at 93 kills, you're not gonna get anything with it. I got a lot of headshots, which was really cool. You know, I need to get um, I'm trying to get dark matter for it. I mean, that shouldn't take too long. But anyways, guys, um, hope you enjoyed the gameplay today. If you did, drop a like, comment, subscribe, guys. 42 and three with the HG40. I'll catch y'all the next one. Have a nice day. Later.